guys! In this SoCraftastic video, I'm going to show you how to make a bomb pop on the rainbow loom! I used to eat these popsicles all the time when I was a kid because they're delicious. They are perfect for the 4th of July theme and summer, of course. Before we get into the tutorial, please give this video a thumbs up if you like it. And also subscribe if you haven't already because I put out new crafty videos every single Friday for Crafty Friday and also sometimes throughout the week like this rainbow loom one you're watching right now. Alright now without further ado, let's loom it up. To make this charm you'll need a hook. I'm using the metal one by Rainbow Loom. Then you'll need four different colors of bands. I'm using 14 red, 13 white, 13 blue, and then 9 for the stitch. Once you have all your bands, make sure that your rainbow loom is set up in the staggered position. Now I'm going to turn it so that the arrow is facing me. We're going to start by wrapping one red rubber band around the hook three times. So it should have three loops like this. Now take two red rubber bands and you're going to slide the loops over this band. I'm just going to move this for a second so the background is clear. So you're just going to pull the three loops over, then put the hook back through the other side. So there should be four loops on the hook now. You're going to grab three more red rubber bands, put these on the end of the hook like we did last time, and then just slide all these onto the middle. It should look like this. And then you're going to stick the hook back through the other side and you should have six loops on the hook now. You're going to put two loops onto this peg very carefully. Now the middle two loops will go on this top middle peg. Make sure these ones don't fall off while you're doing that. Then you'll have two remaining loops to put on the left peg. Your loom should look like this. Now I'm taking two red bands and I'm going to use double bands. So I'm putting two on these pegs here, another set of two bands on the middle, and two more on the right side. Push them down if you need to. Now we're gonna move on to white. Let me zoom in a little bit so you can see what I'm doing better. Again, I'm taking two bands each time. So I'm just going to start by putting two bands on the left side here, two in the middle, and two on the right. Now I'm putting two more white, two more white in the middle, and two white on the right. Now to place the blue, I'm doing two on the left, two in the middle, two on the right, and now we'll want to bring three sets of blue bands to this middle peg here. So I'm going to do the left and right first, two bands on the left to this middle peg, two blue bands on the right, and two blue bands in the middle. Now I'm going to show you how to make the popsicle stick on the hook. You'll want to start with a single band, and this will need to go around your hook four times. So I have it one, two, three, and four, like that. Now you're going to take two bands at a time and you're just going to slide the previous bands over these bands here. So slide all four loops over these two bands. Once those are on, then you're going to put the hook through the other two loops. Now grab two more bands, put them on the end of the hook and you're going to slide these four loops over. Again, once they're on there, put the hook back through the other side of the loop. So there should be four loops on. And again, grab two more rubber bands and put those on the end of the hook and then slide the four loops over it. And then the hook will go back through the two loops on the end and you're going to repeat this one more time with the final two bands for your stick. Again, slide these all onto it. And 
and then your hook goes back through the final two loops. Super easy. Now you're going to transfer the stick from the hook to this middle peg right here. You'll want to place all four loops onto the peg. Before hooking, we're going to add triangle bands. So we're going to add one blue one like this around these three pegs. Then you'll place a white band around these three pegs. And of course, a red one around these three up here. Now it's time to start hooking on this peg right here. First, find out which bands are the top two. In my case, it's the middle. So I'm going to grab inside of all four brown loops. Go ahead and grab the top two blue bands only. Make sure that the brown ones stay around the hook and then you're just going to pull them to the next peg. Put your hook through the brown ones and grab the top two blue ones again. Bring them over to the side peg. And finally we're going to get these two bands so put your hook through Pull them out and over and around the peg. Now I'm going to hook up the entire right side. You're just going to put your hook through and grab the two blue bands at the very bottom to pull up to the next peg. Now pull this band back and grab the two white ones at the bottom. Hook them around this peg. Pull back the white band and grab the bottom two white ones to place around this peg. Push that band back and grab these two. Repeat the same thing on the left side. So I'm going to pull these two bottom bands through those four and onto this peg. Pull this back and grab the bottom two white. Move them to this peg. Push back this white band and grab the two bottom whites. Put them around this one. Push back the red band and pull out the bottom two reds to put right here. And you could probably guess that we're going to repeat that along this middle column as well. The middle is the easiest because you'll just be able to pull them out and move them to the next peg. You'll see the two white ones that you're going to reach in grab and pull to the next peg here. Now get these two whites and put them on this peg and these two reds to put to the final peg on top. And remember that we have to hook the right one to the middle so we're going to just grab this. There should be two bands and put those around the middle and of course the left as the final one. Grab the two bands inside and put them around the middle peg. Make sure all of your bands are hooked at this point. Now place your hook through every single band on the last peg. And you're going to pull one red band through. Make sure the other side goes on. Pull this side of the band over and off of the hook to form a slip knot. Make sure that the knot is going around every single band before you try to pull the charm off of the loom. So once you're sure it's secure, I'm just going to stick the hook through these bands again and it will help me pull them off the peg. Now pull off this side. So keep pulling it off very carefully. and you should have your bomb pop charm. I like to bring my hook through these three bands at the top and then grab this loop through those like that. If you feel like this empty space is kind of weird then you can add two more bands or just do it how you want but I choose a couple bands stick my hook through them then I'll pull these two bands through Now I'll pull the loop at the top through those four bands. So pull it through. 
and then you'll have to find a way to re-knot it Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this charm tutorial. If you did, please click the like button. And also, if you're not subscribed to this so craftastic channel of mine, please stay a while and hit the subscribe button before you leave. And if you just can't get enough Rainbow Loom, then go ahead and check out my Rainbow Loom playlist. The link is in the description box below. I've recently made a Rainbow Loom pineapple charm, the Monster Tail Phrase for Days bracelet. I hope you guys have a great rest of the day. Remember to check me out on Instagram. My username is Sarah Lynn T, and I'm having an Instagram giveaway until July 13th, 2014. So go ahead and check that out and follow me on there, and I will see you soon. Bye! Before we get into the... T Ow! That didn't really hurt, but I knocked it off my leg. There's a hair hanging from my bum pop. So yeah, there was some noise up in here. Rainbow Lou! <laughs> Popsicles are yummy. I am so cool. Cool like popsicle. Get it? Actually, they're freezing. Bye.